Now to a developing story in Missouri City. A deadly workplace shooting inside a massive food distribution center. A woman opened fire on two co-workers, killing one of them. She also died, but investigators say they don't yet know if she killed herself or whether she was shot by an officer. Now in the hours after the shooting, this chilling video surfaced. The shooter talking about what she was about to do. New at 6 o'clock, Ryan Korsgaard getting new insight into the shooter from her father-in-law. Ryan? And her father-in-law says he felt like something was wrong very early this morning, so he called his son, who also works here, and he did not quickly get an answer. Need assistance active shooter. Just after 2 o'clock this morning, Missouri City Police were in a gunfight. They say Christine Perales shot two employees at the Ben E. Keith Distribution Center in Missouri City. Police say she also fired at them. 9-8, she's right in front of you. Manager Francisco Reyes was killed. Employee Ferencio Hannes was rushed to the hospital with a gunshot wound to the leg. Perales died. Whether or not the, uh, the shooter actually was uh, in, hit by one of our officer's bullets or if it was self-inflicted, we're not totally sure at this point. It is your fault. I'm sorry for everything. I didn't want it to end like this. Perales appeared to apologize during this video posted to Facebook. She also said she had been pushed too hard for too long. Her father-in-law confirms this is Perales. Tell my grandma I love her. I'm not crazy. In a note posted to Facebook not long before the shooting, she said her life was threatened 12 years ago and was left with two options, either kill herself or be killed. She said, quote, suicide isn't an option because I want to go to heaven. However, I'm not going to allow someone to make me their victim without a fight. Her father-in-law says his family is confused and in shock. They're just as devastated as I am, probably. Of course, they're even more devastated because their loved ones is gone. And he said right now he does not know exactly what happened or where she got that gun. We're live in Missouri City. Ryan Korsgaard, KPRC, Channel 2 News.